Let's we'll start with the SEC on CBS Saturday afternoon. Alabama at Arkansas. Arkansas coming off that loss to AM. They were very sad, driving all the way back from Jerry World to Fayetteville. Look, they think they can win this game. Danny, we had Houston Nutt on earlier today, and he was saying, I think they can win this yeah. game as well. Um, Arkansas, or excuse me, Alabama favored by 16 and a half, though, on the road. Does any one. team going to play a game think they can't win the game? Okay, yeah. but you know what I mean? Like, I mean, they really, like, they've lost. To Alabama 15 times in a row. That's right. Out of maybe all of those 15 games, this is the most belief their fans have in them to win. Houston Nuts, my guy. Right? That's what I'm saying. Brady's but he also he like likes Arkansas every week. A little bit, a little bit. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but more importantly, whether they can win the game, who cares? We want to know how they do against the number. Yeah. And I actually like them against the number here. I do. Uh, this is a team that, you know, a uh, botched stretch for the end zone by K.J. Jefferson, if he's able to get that in, it's 21-7, and right. that game could have different ended game. completely different. And had they dominated that game against Texas A&M and come out with a big win, I think this number might be a little bit tighter. So I also look at Alabama, and they haven't exactly been tested. And the one time they were tested against Texas, they barely got by with the win. Texas didn't have their quarterback for the majority of the game, and it wasn't great. For Alabama, so I'm very curious to see. I think Alabama, I think that they're going to win. Like I'm not calling for the outright upset, but I think Arkansas does make a game of this. The environment's going to be crazy. I do think they have an incredible belief in their team. Oh, what's that? Yeah, yeah, exactly. I do think that. <laughs> and Sam Pittman is—they're buying what he is selling. He, by the way, he's a great quote machine. By the way, and somebody you would love to play for. But I do think they keep this in the numbers. So I'll go ahead and take Arkansas in a lower-scoring game. I'll go ahead and take Arkansas. Let's go back to where Alabama struggled earlier on the road this year in Austin versus Texas. What you saw was Bryce Young constantly pestered by that defense for Texas, that front getting pressure on him. Who's the best team getting sacks in the SEC right now, Danny? Ooh, Arkansas. Arkansas. That's right. They lead with 20. And by the way, it's not even Four close. More. Yeah. So we know they're really good at getting pressure on opposing quarterbacks. We know KJ Jefferson doesn't really turn over the football. They're going to eat up clock with that rushing attack, but they can make some big plays in the passing game too. So I'm with you. I think Arkansas is able to keep this thing close at home, playing to that home crowd. Uh, don't get twisted. Alabama wins the game. They've got the best player in the country in Bryce Young at quarterback, okay? But at the end of the day, I think you're going to see Arkansas keep this thing within the number. A little lock unity to begin our yeah. program. I